Hi, I'm John Luke, because I'm the one cooking today. <laughs> I'm actually John Luke. And I'm actually Nick. But Nick is actually cooking. Yes, I'm the one who's actually been able to start using the Instant Pot. That's not true. I make chicken. And yes. I make but I mean for the eggs. So today I don't a, make eggs. Today's actually a very simple uh, one. I think we're calling this Instant Pot 101. We're going to show you how to make hard boiled eggs in the Instant Pot. Very simple, very easy. Which have now become our favorite hard boiled yeah. eggs. Yes. The case, the yolk is creamier, we find, not as dry as when you boil it on the yeah. stove. It doesn't seem to get overcooked. Yeah. And we do it slightly differently, so online everybody says it's one, one, uh, it's one cup of water and then you put it for five minutes. Um, we actually put it for six minutes, so we'll start right now. So we are making all our weekly eggs, so I'm going to be putting uh, eight eggs in for our weekly and we're also going to have some for lunch. So we're putting 12 eggs in total in here, so that's four. Oh, I was like, 12 is four and I just, I'm not good at math. 10, 11, 12. I'll show you guys what it looks like in here. So you have the little basket that comes with this a trivet. A trivet, yeah. And so you put that in the bottom and then you put your eggs on top, all like within one layer. And it doesn't matter the amount of eggs you put in, it'll all work for as many eggs as you want, as long as it fits into the um, Indian spot. And then we will take a one cup. Is it a cup of water? Yes, a cup Make of sure water. the cup is that, that cup. Sometimes it doesn't it's expanded. collapse correctly, or it's not fully. But it was one cup of water, that's it. Dump it in. You close the machine. And then make sure you put it on ceiling. Ceiling. So yeah. there's a there's a setting back here. You turn it to make sure it's on ceiling, not on venting. Yep. And in the front here, you have your settings. So basically what you're gonna do is you're gonna set it to steam. And then we put it for six minutes. Like I said earlier, usually people put five, we put six just to cook it just a little bit more. And so now it's it. You put the six minutes, you wait till it pressurizes and it'll start. So see, beeps, ready to go. So it's gonna start pressurizing and start cooking. So we'll let you guys and know. We're gonna get exercise while uh, you ready. guys get this going. So I'm gonna start walking around. Okay, I'll follow up. So now, that seemed like it took forever. I know, I, thought, I think we took a nap that much. I thought, kind of fell asleep. So what we usually do is now we have to turn it to uh, venting. So I use a uh, cloth because I don't want to burn myself. So what I usually do is I just wrap my hand around it. Yep, or we use our glove oven mitts as our well. Oven mitts as well, but I'm just that. And we kind of leave our Instapot on the counter as you notice. We don't have it on our countertop underneath our covers because we don't want the steam to actually damage yeah. Uh, the wood because it can do that and this is extremely dangerous everybody we do want to warn you that yeah. when you do use this make sure that this machine is vented completely before you try opening it and basically what you're doing is you're capturing all this um, pressure. heat and pressure on the yeah. inside and that's what's cooking and making things cook faster yeah so we're just gonna wait till faster faster faster, faster. We're waiting till this is ready to go it's still not ready so there's a little metal knob here that's gonna I think it's already went it's down, so I think it's ready to go. Already. Yeah, yeah. So we're going to go right now and start. Yeah, there you go. Like this. And voila. I love how it makes noise. It goes... And the eggs are done, so I'm grabbing the same mat. And I'm going to bring it over to my sink here. So yes. I can switch I'm over. going to switch over just a little bit as we speak. So most people who... We're now done, in the sink. Most people who have done this recipe, we, we've been told that you need to um, put it in a... Uh, ice bath. We actually have not been doing that. Nope. We basically grab the eggs, put them in a large bowl, and then just run cold water underneath it for a little yeah. bit. You could probably even just run cold water in there. Oh yeah. Right yeah, on yeah. that. I was like, I was like, I, I thought that's what you were gonna do. Well, there you go. Look at that. So basically, two all, brains always work better than one. So that's basically all you do. You basically, uh, at least for us, put some cold water in there, let it cool off, and then peel them, and then you're ready to go. It's a very easy recipe, and the eggs come out amazing. Your inside is actually not as solid as it is when you boil it. I find when you're boiling an egg, it gets really dry. It gets dry because you don't really know the exact timing. In this yes. Instapot, 
as soon as it's cooked, it beeps, you take them out. And you're Sometimes done. you have eggs boiling on this stove and you miss the time, you miss the time and you're like, boiling, is it so. early, is it too late? So that's really a handy thing about the Instapot. Yeah. So if you guys try this, let us know, post in the comments below, how do you do your eggs in the Instapot? I want to crack one. Go ahead. And uh, you can find us on all social media using hashtag WWGays. So you can also find us on our website, WWGays.com. We are hoping to do more Instant Pot recipes. We thought this would be a good one to start with because it's very simple and easy to do. And it's something that we need to do anyways to get prep for the week. So, Jonik is peeling an egg I'm right now. I'm peeling one right now because I'm not yet to peel one. Nick's been doing all the eggs for us. It, and it's, what's cool about the Instant Pot too, guys, is every time I've done it, every egg is peeled easily. It's not like when you're boiling it. Usually you have issues I'm sometimes. I'm not having the issues so far. Look at that. Yeah, so he's already peeling it. So peeling, peeling, peeling. So see how easy it comes apart? Like it's amazing, yeah, it's guys. Yeah, really so cool. So for one reason that we are happy to have this Instant Pot now is to make hard-boiled eggs. We definitely- as, as silly as this sounds, but when it makes your life easier, might as well do it, right? Yeah. If you can do something to make your life easy, and I wanna actually cut it open so you can see what the inside looks like. So I usually just use a little cutting knife. And voila. Voila, look at that. Oh, you can see the steam. Yeah. So thanks for watching guys. Thanks if you like the video, click like below and subscribe. Yeah. Bye everybody. Bye.